Hey everybody, I'm your man Dennis from AFR with the guy you want to talk to, Scott. If you want to buy a set of cylinder heads, you know you want the best, but are you buying the right cylinder head? That's what we're going to dive into this guy's head and find out why you buy AFR and more importantly, what you buy from AFR. All right, Scott, take us through those steps. As I mentioned, people want the high quality product, but there's so much to it. Talk about that experience when people come to AFR. Well, your typical phone call we get would be, um, it's simple. What cylinder head do I need for my engine? Can you help me figure it out? A lot of the time it's, it, 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 they don't know or they think they know and they want, hey, I want this big, big cylinder head on my engine. Um, when we figure it out, you know, uh, uh, one of the misconceptions is um, port volume. Port volume, port volume, port volume. They want to know, you know, uh, is it the 220 head? Is it the 235 head? Is it the two, you know, 245, the 195? Really, it's, uh, if, if you want to break it down, and those are good numbers, but port volume for me is one of the, maybe the third thing or fourth thing or something like that, that you kind of, that, that I think about. Really, bore size and valve size relationship should be kind of like the, you know, the primary thing you think about. You can't go sticking, let's say, a 2125 valve in, or you shouldn't be sticking a 2125 valve into a 4030 bore, a four inch bore. Shouldn't be. Um, that's not like your best case scenario. RPM, that's another thing. Um, uh, RPM application, you're not gonna really, you know, have something that's, you know, an, an 8,000 RPM type application and a uh, with a 195cc head or vice versa. Um, Cross-sectional cross -sectional was the second thing. I mentioned uh, uh, valve size relationship to the bore as being a primary. Um, Cross-sectional area inside the runner is, is it acts like a, a, a restrictor plate, if you will, in the runner. That becomes, at a certain airspeed, like a, um, uh, like that restrictor plate. So really volume, as you can think about now, as you, as you think about those two things, the volume becomes irrelevant. You can go, I want to, you know, t will a 220, well, a 220 will work on that head, really? Well, the volume really doesn't matter. The restrictor plate in the rudder becomes the, the most important thing. So I kind of go, okay, what RPM, what restrictor plate will work with that? What valve size will work with your bore? And then I kind of work from there. And then really, okay, what volume head did that end up being? So the, the volume kind of takes care of itself. I noticed when you're talking to customers here, one of the things you always have handy is a small calculator. And that's one of the things that people don't realize yeah, as you reach for it. Yeah. Um, one of the things that people don't realize is just how important the math is behind picking the right cylinder head. I mean, as you said, the biggest and baddest is not always the right choice. What's the response from the customer who realizes that they want the big one, they want, they want the big 245, but they realize they only need a 195. Are they, are they responsive to that? Uh, yeah, actually, to be honest with you, once you realize and you crunch some numbers and they hear the calculator going away and you, they actually ask, well, what are you doing? And you, you, they actually hear the map and you know, you know that you're not the only call that they're getting. They're shopping around like they do for TV sets or anything else in the world. You know, you're not the only call they're making. But every everybody else, I'm sure that they're calling, they're just getting, yeah, uh, yeah, stick the 220 on it. Yeah, just stick to whatever. They just want to get rid of the phone call. When you call us at AFR, and not just me, this isn't about just me. Um, I give the best tech that I can. Um, uh, but everybody else, you know, the, the, the you know, Alex and, and Jeremy and Josh, the other guys that I work with there, they're sharp. Um, and what, and more importantly, we give what I feel, what sets us apart, you know, and let me back up a little bit. 25, 30 years ago, we were one of the only game in town as far as being, you know, the best cylinder heads. We still are one of the best, if not the best cylinder heads, and I truly believe that, apples to apples comparison. But we're not the only best cylinder head anymore. There's a lot of good products out here. 
But what separates us more so than anything besides our good products is the customer service that you get when you call us. It's, it's something you don't find anymore. When they hear the time that I take to actually go answer that question, not just with a short answer, throw the 195 on it or throw the 220, and I actually crunch numbers and I try to figure out what really is exactly going on, no, they're not upset or they're not like, oh, they're not disappointed. It's not the large head that they wanted initially. They actually are very happy that I took the time to do that and they understand it and they're more than happy to take that answer. For AFR. But one of the most satisfying, best things I do is just simply helping customers um, uh, figure out, help them figure out what they need, help them end up with a better mousetrap and um, you know, and have long life and have a long, happy, satisfying life. Helping them get pinned in the seat and uh, you know, get good dyno numbers and get them, you know, just get them, you know, with an engine that's gonna not only last a long time, but get make the power that they want, the torque that they want, uh, you know, beat their buddy when they go racing, uh, you know, whatever their goals are, because you've got to find out what the goal is. Initially on the call, what's your goal? Help them find the goal and achieve it. And then when you do that and you get them at the end of the phone call, when they're, thank you, thank you. When they're truly thankful at the end of the phone call, and you hang up, that's like getting, you know, you, you couldn't have somebody walk up and hand you cash and give, you know, like give you money as like a, a tip or a bonus and make you feel any better. I, just the thank you is enough for me. That's, that's what makes me satisfied. All right, Scott, that's what I think people want to hear. When they get a hold of AFR, they want to know that they can talk to a guy like you and get the right cylinder head, maybe just not the one they thought they needed. If we want to send them or find you, what do we do? Go to the website or call the phone number, 661-257-8124, extension 124, and ask for Scott. You heard him, extension 124. You'll get this man on the phone. This is AFR right here, PRI 2021.